In Japan, what was supposed to be a weekend alpine excursion has turned into tragedy. A volcano in the central part of the country erupted today. It caught hundreds of mountain climbers off guard. About 250 people were initially trapped on the mountain. Most have been rescued, but not all. Jacques Berbeau reports. Yeah, it was not the kind of hike they were expecting. This group of mountain climbers was caught by surprise when Japan's second highest volcano, Mount Antake, erupted. As billowing clouds of ash crept down the mountainside, the hikers try to outrun them. But it's a futile effort. Ash begins to rain down. Quickly, it gets darker and darker, the ash falling more heavily, breathing becoming more difficult. <laughs> Officials say hundreds of people were climbing the volcano when it erupted. One woman is dead, dozens injured, stranded or missing. Prompting Japan's Prime Minister Shinzo Abe to order the military to mount a rescue operation. We are looking into the disaster, says Abe, and I have made the order to give the utmost effort in rescuing any possible victims and remaining climbers still on the mountain. Officials say there are dozens of people collapsed along the mountain trails, while about 200 people found shelter at a lodge near the summit. The volcano has sent a plume of smoke and ash high into the sky, forcing the diversion of two flights that were scheduled to land in Tokyo 200 kilometers away. The last time this volcano erupted was in 2007. This eruption is rated as a three on a scale of one to five, meaning it could have been a lot worse. Jopper Bo, Global News.